Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. 90 Day Fiancé Did Gino's bachelor party lead to a breakup with Jasmine? What we know about the event 90 Day Fiancé Season 10 star Jasmine Pineda was informed about a secret bachelor party that Gino Palazzolo had one day before she moved to the US 90 Day Fiancé alum Gino Palazzolo's secret bachelor party is leading to a shocking rift with fiancé Jasmine Pineda on season 10. Jasmine, a 36-year-old from Panama, became engaged to the 53-year-old Gino Palazzolo on 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Day Season 4. Jasmine and Gino have had their ups and downs in the past three years and came close to breaking up more than once. They still decided to continue their relationship. Jasmine came to the US on a K-1 visa. However, within days of her moving there, Jasmine found a lip gloss tube in Gino's truck, which, according to her, meant that he was cheating. Jasmine met Gino's cousin Dana's wife, Michelle, at a nail spa. Jasmine wanted to get some pampering done to take her mind off her fights with Gino. Michelle had become the only member of Gino's family Jasmine felt safe with. Jasmine thought Michelle was not judgmental and was open to getting to know Jasmine better. Michelle suggested they do a girls' night. Jasmine agreed, because she needed a break from being Gino's maid and cleaner. Michelle suggested that since Gino already had a bachelor party, they could get some girlfriends and have some fun together. Jasmine realized that Gino hadn't told her about having a bachelor party at all. Gino had a secret bachelor party in America. Gino had told Jasmine that he was not having a bachelor party until she came to America. 90 Day Fiancé star Jasmine was going to be the one organizing it. Michelle informed her that Gino threw the party the day before Jasmine moved to the US Jasmine now wanted to know what Gino did at the party. Perhaps Jasmine already had an idea, but still wanted to confirm her suspicions by getting Michelle to tell her. Michelle told her that Gino had gone to a strip club. Gino went to a strip club. Jasmine wanted to understand what happened to Gino at the strip club. She asked Michelle whether there would have been women touching Gino or if Gino was just sitting there looking at women dancing. You know, it was a bachelor party. I'm sure he got touched. Michelle explained. Jasmine was shocked to know what Gino had been doing behind her back. Will Jasmine end her engagement with Gino? All this while, Jasmine had been feeling guilty for getting mad at Gino. She was being hard on herself and blaming herself for everything because of her extreme jealousy. Jasmine regretted not having trusted her instincts because she turned out to be right. The preview for the next episode of 90 Day Fiancé showed Jasmine asking Gino what he did before the day she arrived. A flashback showed Gino surrounded by two scantily dressed women as he slapped one of their behind. You act like I cheated on you on something, said Gino, while Jasmine cried. That's the way it feels. Jasmine walked away saying, I'm not going doing asterisk, 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 asterisk with his man. As Jasmine weeps, the cameras show her ring lying on the floor next to her after she's thrown it away. The shot suggests Jasmine and Gino's engagement is over and there's no chance of her getting back with him. So far, there has been no confirmation that Jasmine and Gino got married in 90 Day Fiancé. Jasmine still appears to be in the US as per her Instagram, but Gino is nowhere to be seen with her or on her feed. Even though they have split in the past and gotten back together, this could have been the last straw that ended Jasmine and Gino's relationship. Thanks for watching.